What's going on guys? When we beast you and today we're back with another Let's Play video for GTA 5. This is part 19 I believe. I'm going to continue to do some more missions. I'm going to start off with uh, Lester's assassination mission. I looked at my book on how to do it so I know what I'm going to be doing so I won't be failing like first time or anything. So it looks like I've just got to go to a payphone again like the last one. Ever heard of Jackson Skinner? He's head of product development at Facade. Man, we must read different magazines. And the bastard made a fortune selling customer data to the highest bidder from Moscow to Tehran. He's handing it to the cyber terrorists on a fucking silver platter. Okay, dog, chill. Shit, chill. I got you, man. What's the play? I'm reliably informed that he has a weakness for working girls. There's a regular he likes to pick up in La Puerta. You stake her out, and she should lead you to Skinner. I'll send you the location. Meanwhile, maybe I'll take another look at the fruit share price. <laughs> Alright, homie. I'll be in touch. Yeah, um, apparently you can, um, if you go to the stock market on one of the website pages, um, you can, if you invest in, uh, fruit for this mission, if you invest in quite a lot of the shares, you'll get loads of money from it after killing this guy, so I just want to check if I can do any at the moment, because it wouldn't let me go on it for some reason, so we've got money and services, and this one... But it always it keeps saying the market is down for me, and so it looks like I can't do it. I don't know why. But if you invest your money on the fruit shares, um, look for the one that has got the company called Fruit on it. Put as many shares as you can, and then you'll literally invest in a lot of money, and also probably get an achievement out of it as well. So I'm gonna find this guy. Gotta think. You gotta wait for some prostitutes to sh um, show up. Wait for it decline all the people until she finally accepts someone then basically you uh, just kill the guy she uh, goes with which is that Skinner guy that we gotta assassinate so it's not too hard of a mission it's pretty simple to be honest and it looks at the pay for it it's actually only three thousand dollars for getting paid for this mission so it's a bit shitter than all the rest but still a bit of money I wouldn't mind getting paid that much damn that must be my girl Okay, the prostitute enters the car and watch for the vehicle that she enters and kill the driver. So what I'm going to basically be doing is a drive-by style and when I get to him. That's not the guy. It's an open roof car, I think. That the person's is. Nope, she declined him, so let's just move up a little bit. Wait for this guy to turn up. She's going to be coming this way, more or less. Hmm. Where is this person? This might be our guy. If not, then I don't know what to do. Okay, that's cool. It's not that person. This is our man, I think. Hey, baby! You miss me? I was starting to think you weren't coming. You know, I don't even feel there bad. There you go. Drive by style. Epic. That was an easy assassination mission, I'm not gonna lie. Hey man, I'll wipe that software for you. Ah, excellent news. I'll speak to you soon. Okay, that was an easy mission. Oh, we earned 5,000. I've seen the escape bonus. Oh, sweet. So it looks like we earned more than we did, because we got the bonus as well. Okay, I'm probably gonna switch to Michael for the next, uh main mission so I don't know why the radio is playing so I'm gonna switch to Michael I think now for the next mission I think I'm play as Trevor as well but or do it as Trevor except as Trevor whatever but I'm gonna do it as Michael because I haven't played as Michael in a long time I'm always playing as Franklin or Trevor 
lately and looks like he's on by the beach. Wonder what he's doing or is he stuck in traffic? This traffic is bullshit! Uh, let's just mark it on that map where we gotta go. Oh, it's close by. Um, that you must have been going to the sh you must have uh, been going to here, which is basically you uh, phone or go with Dave or his psychologist who was in the beginning of the game, and you basically just go to him for extra money and learn about his like sort of backstory in a way. So that's kind of interesting. Maybe I'll do that in another video if I have time to do it. But I'm just gonna read you off, and then I'm gonna just go and do this Solomon mission and then maybe possibly another mission because that mission was really short to be honest and I'm getting the hang of the assassination missions because I'm just following my walkthrough book which is pretty simple and I want to get gold on all of them so if I get gold on all of them that should be cool but we're almost there we just gotta go around here I think but I don't think we can go through those gates by there because I think the police might get onto us so I'm just going to go the route it's telling me to go. And this is Michael's personal car, I think, but I know his daughter has a red open-topped uh, sort of car and his son had a yellow Jeep that we robbed in the very first mission, or second mission we did. It looks like we got to speak to this guy, maybe, or... No? How's it going? Sometimes I don't know, man. Uh, I think maybe he's in the studio, maybe. He must be. Because he's not out here. Looks like I gotta go round into here, maybe. I thought that was the guy, but obviously not. Thank you. Yep, looks like this in here. Just call me when you're ready. Okay, let's just get out and go and see Mr. Solomon. Let's see what's going to be happening here then. Hello. Come in, come in. Thanks. You must be Michael. Yeah. You know, I used to have three secretaries. Now I have to make my own coffee and give myself a happy ending. <laughs> see, the ships are coming in. But the walls will hold us. Nelson in Naples. Pluto? I said Mars, you cocksucker! <laughs> Shoulder of Orion. Two. Devin Weston said you were a fan. Huge fan. Tell me, Michael. Devin Weston. Did he... Does he want you to bump me off? No, not at all. He said you were retiring but might need some help on a movie. Only assholes retire, Michael. Him and my son, they want to put me out to pasture so they can turn this place into condos or a theme park or something. But this place is a dream factory. Well, maybe they have different dreams. Some days, I don't blame them. You know, they always say, never work with children or animals. Well, I want to add to that list. Never work with directors or actors. This picture is going to kill me. All right. So what's it about? It's perfect. Set in Liberty City. Meltdown! It's all being shot on green screen right out back there. We take a look at the financial crisis, and then we boil it all down into a really simplistic battle between two yuppies. With lots of training montages. So what's the problem? Milton McElroy. I cast him in the second lead because he's cheap. Zero talent, incidentally. Well, he's got this new agent, Rocco Pelosi. He's been hassling us about renegotiating the deal. So now, he's holding up shooting until he gets paid. That sounds problematic. It would be if the director wanted to shoot. Anton Baudelaire. Ever heard of him? That doesn't surprise me. Now he's having a mental breakdown, pissing all over himself who knows where. <sighs> all right. Looks like you got yourself that new assistant. But no happy endings. <laughs> I love you already! <laughs> that guy's obsessed with animals all over the place. He got some lion on the wall and a bloody tiger rug. Jeez. Okay, looks like we just gotta do this mission to him and see what we gotta do. We just gotta go to East Los Santos, I said. It's not too sure. 
Um, if I have time, I'll probably do the next um, assassination mission for Franklin, maybe, but that's if I have time. Because it's only 10 minutes roughly gone now, possibly, and I'm not too sure. I think it's coming up to 10 minutes anyway. Um, but then the assassination for mission for him, I think, is you have to steal a bus, wait for the target to get on, and then assassinate him, or something like that. Something similar along those lines. But it sounds cool, but hey, Solomon! I'm just doing that thing. Good, good. Now, I realized in my excitement, I forgot some details. Yeah, it seemed obvious. You want this Pelosi guy clipped? No, God no. Is that an option? No, no, no. Bad idea, bad idea. No clipping anyone. Just teach him some manners. He's also in my director's ear as well, if you'd believe it. So teach this punk a lesson and bring the talent back to set. Ideally, in a more collaborative mood. I'll see what I can do. They all gonna be at the club? I'm told it isn't a club so much as a rat pit. Anton and Milton are supposed to be there, and Pelosi's on the way to pick them up. He's taking them to his lawyer to sign the contracts, so if he hears there's someone from the studio coming, he'll get him out fast. All right. I'll go in quiet. I'll see you on the set, boss. Okay, looks like we've got to do this sort of teach this guy a lesson or something. So I'm guessing 50 cuffs, maybe? Possibly, but I'm not too sure, and I've got a bit of wind coming up. Just out of the drink. Oof. Okay, almost there. It's on the other side of the road, and I end up crashing. Typical for me. Shut up, you fucking Mexican. You're in my spot. I see some bad drivers, but you. <laughs> that was epic, what you just said. So I do so. Okay, so what we gotta do now? Looks like a helicopter, and maybe we gotta teach one of the guys a lesson. How you like this space? It's gonna be an EDM paradise. There's gonna be sparklers stuck in bottles, implants, tramp stamps, all the real shit. That's Pelosi Entertainment. Now give me a minute here, just a minute. I gotta go grab something inside. Johnny, we nearly got the club. We're finally a go. Now you take care of these guys. No cold feet. Okay? Let's go. Okay, looks like we got a without a lit in Rocco. Okay. So I don't know how I'm supposed to be doing this, but looks like our oh, stamina's gone up to hundred. Very nice. Okay, maybe we gotta. Ah, I see. Got a jumper. On this, maybe. Hmm. Looks like we got a jumper on. There we go. No, I want to jump up. I said I want to jump up. There. No, it won't let me jump up there, okay. Where have I gotta go then? They might be too high to notice, but this roof will come down on their heads. Hmm. Which one? Oh, there's a ladder there. I thought maybe. I'm guessing I'm gonna have to yeah, try some stealth, stealth kills now. Okay, looks like I just gotta try sneak past here. You better have a fat okay, I'm gonna try sneak on this guy. Okay, there we go. Oh shit. Okay, I don't know how that guy see me, but okay. I don't even know how he see me. How am I supposed to alert, get not alert, get alerted by that guy when he's literally right by there? The first guy was easy to take out, but looks like I know where I gotta go anyway, so... 
Okay, looks like I can go this way. Let's follow this way again. Let me just do that on my laptop before it goes into standby mode. You know, I should have put an attachment or something on. Ah, I got suppressed on the assault rifle. Okay. Okay, looks like I was trying to see why I had a, a suppressor on, but I've only got it on the AK-47. <laughs> Look at that position he landed in. Why that guy? I don't even know how the fuck. Okay, looks like we Who's got this to him. Hey, you! Oh, turns out these guys are in love with their contract, so they'll be going back to the set with me. Can you believe this fucking clown? No, this guy's all mine. <laughs> okay. I can't remember how to fucking block. Come on, fucking, fucking up. Bitch, bitch. We're gonna make a new deal. You leave my people alone, and I don't toss you off this roof. Oh uh, yeah. Okay. Sure, man. Sure. All right. Pussy. Let's get back to the lot. Again, the helicopter looks like I gotta drive whoa, this whoa, or hey. play this. Look, you can bully him, but you can't bully talent, buddy. We are not shooting until I get a new deal. Can't bully talent? Just watch me. You're gonna be a good boy when I'm done. Okay, where we gotta go? I don't know who you think Scare you Milton and I'm some fuck find high speed and the bridges or danger close to buildings. I'm Solomon the Sith. Okay. okay, looks like I just gotta scare them. Like driving under bridges and stuff, maybe. That's kind of weird. This guy is pissing his pants. Not cool. Enough. Oh, enough. All right, I'll do the shitty movie <laughs> for the shitty money. I'll do anything you want. I'll blow you and just stop. Blow me? What the fuck are you talking about? You come to your senses. I'll take you to the studio. That was weird. What he just said. I don't want. I don't want that to happen. Thank you very much. Michael's hey, married with. No. What? I a wife and two kids. Mr. Richards. Would I be in pain? No, you should apologize to me. A brutal honesty, bud. You're not that good. It feels phoned in. You're lucky you're working at all. <laughs> you're kidding me, right? I am an artist, dude. I'm pure apologizing. When you see Solomon, you say, Sorry for the misunderstanding, sir. And you will always... Always appreciate the opportunity he's given you. Look, I just wanted a better deal. Everyone wants a better deal. Everyone serving coffee, selling cars, typing in spreadsheets wants a better deal. Now, 
Where am I putting this thing down? When Devin Weston came to do a studio visit, he used the empty water tank. Alright, then we'll do the same. I see where I gotta land it. Right on this Put it blue. there! The water tank turned parking lot! Send it down! Let's just land this carefully. Here we go. Okay, looks like we gotta go to his office. I know Solomon is anxious to see you. <laughs> there we go. What a wonderful surprise, Anton, my boy. You're an artist, I know that! And this story is the best kind of art. A simplistic, cliché-ridden pile of dross that you will turn into magic. Get a grip, I love ya! So, Solomon, Milton here has a little something he wants to say to you. Say it. Ah, uh, I, I just, just want to say that I'm sorry for any misunderstanding, sir. And I, I appreciate all the opportunities that, that, that you've given me. Of course, of course. Michael, what can I say? You're a natural. I love you. Well, you're too kind. No, no, I mean it. I don't mean to presume. But would it be okay if I gave you a shout? This shoot seems cursed for some reason or another. I need an associate producer. I'd love that. We'll talk soon. I gotta go. Oh, hell yeah. Nice. Looks like we're in cahoots with Solomon Richards. That's cool. I love how it says new contact all the time. Can touch this 2.0. Looks like I wasn't allowed to get hit. I think the 2.0 is from when we fought, um, what's his name? When we first did it. But, wait, oh yeah, my car's here. What am I doing? Martin, who's this? Hey, Mr. Madrazo. How's that rebuild going? Good. I need to see you. Come to La Fuerta Blanca, my ranch off Senora Road, and bring Mr. Clinton. Hey, look. Franklin? I hardly know the kid. I don't want him caught up in this. You'll need another pair of hands. All right, there's another guy. Trevor Phillips. Me and him are partners. Okay. I'll have to... Shit! You twat. Oh, Jesus. You are getting you fucking out of this car. Don't fight. That's for fucking running me over. And now I gotta lose the cops because of you. And what bent music are you listen to? Okay, looks like I just gotta go this way. I'm gonna go to the right. I lose the cops and I'm gonna change to Franklin. Because I wanna do the Leicester mission. I wonder if I can actually just... Nah, I can at the moment. But I want it. Okay, that's fine. Just go down this side alley here. And hide. Okay, now we can switch. Let's switch to Franklin and do another assassination mission since we've already done 23 minutes of this, roughly. Okay, looks like he's back in his crib. Well, I think he is anyway. Yep, he's in his house. This is the crib I showed you guys without the audio in part 16, I think it was. So yeah, this is his house. It's a pretty good house to be honest, but I'm gonna get out of here. I can't remember where the door was. Ah, it's by here. Okay, have I got my car? I better have. No, I haven't. Where's my. Oh, there is. Just like spawn right there. Okay, I'm gonna mark Lester's mission on the map. It's not that far away, it's just down the road. A couple of blocks, two, three blocks. Down the road, as Americans just call them blocks, I just say down the road, two streets, whatever. So yeah. Uh, just gonna, gonna do this one last assassination. What? Okay. Okay. 
Okay, I don't know what happened to the car there, but that was weird. Switch the radio off. Just gonna get to this mission quick as possible. And then do the assassination mission and I'll probably finish the video off because it won't be that much time I guess. I'm trying to aim for 30 minutes plus on my videos I'm going to be doing so hopefully this will be just over 30 when I've done this mission. Okay just gotta go down here and do this. Okay. Looks like we'll probably get another phone call from a what's my call it. Yep. Looks like we just gotta answer the phone. So who the fuck don't you like today? Guys called Isaac Penny, ruthless vulture capitalist, about to take a controlling interest in Vapid Motor Company and sell thousands of workers down the river. Penny's uh, one of those tight fisted billionaires, rides the same bus to and from work every day. I was thinking you could take over the route and... Drop the ass off where he needs to go. I got it. Good. Oh, one thing. If I was you, I wouldn't buy any vapid stock until the acquisition falls through. Okay, so go to the bus. Let's get, get the car then. What are you doing? Just, I know scratch and that, but come on. Okay, let's get in this car now. Why is that guy calling me a cocksucker? Idiot. Okay, just down this road and down here. Looks like we gotta steal this bus, then we got to what I call it find the target and assassinate it. So, not too much of a mission, not too hard. I like the assassination missions, but there's only five of them, and this is the fourth one, I think it is. So, we only got one more after this. Just get on the bus. Um, I'm a new bus driver today, guys. I am Franklin. I'm going to be your driver today, so sit back and relax. Now, move out my way, Mr. Fatso. Okay, this. This is going to be hard to drive since it's a long vehicle. Okay, looks like I just got to do all the stops for everyone to come on the bus. Looks like they're all hey, coming sorry on. I'm late. It's my first day on the job. I hope the traffic isn't too bad. Yesterday it took me three hours to go half a mile. Three hours to go half a mile. Okay, looks like we just gotta go on the stops on our little bus route and then just pick up the passengers and then hopefully one of them comes on the bus and then we kill him. Damn, would it kill you people to crack a smile? Yeah, crack a smile, why don't you? Okay, looks like we're just doing this. Looks like there's a green light for this one. We'll go. Doing our duties as a bus driver. Okay, looks like we hey, got this guy. Get in, we running late. Okay, looks like we just gotta continue doing these stops maybe. Hey. What happened to the old bus driver? I really like that guy. Well, you got me, so deal with it, bitch. Okay, next turn on the left. Fuck the traffic, I'm going for it. Hey, Move out. We got no seatbelts back here. Sorry, but this guy's in my way. Jesus, have you been drinking? Look out, man. Yeah, I have been drinking. Got a problem? Okay, so maybe it's on this guy on this spot. Well, you're late, late, late. That'd be one fifth. Mr. Penny, ain't it? Bear hike. Forget about it. Spent thrifts. Okay, looks like we gotta chase him. Hey! Blame it on the city. Oh wait, no, no, no. He's going. 
Thank you for riding LS Transit. Just Fucking bastard. Got him. Oh, fuck. Shit. Let's get out of here. Oh, why, thank you. I'll rob your car. Get out the car. Get out the car. I've got a job to do. Made you off. Okay, I think we maybe have got to lose the police, maybe. Green light. Good to go. Okay, looks like I don't have to lose the police. Hit and run bonus. Ah, too bad I didn't get that one, but oh well. Yep. Looks like I have to run him over and kill him, but that's all good in the hood. So anyway guys, um, thanks for watching. Make sure to give this video a like if you enjoyed it. Comment on what you feel. Feedback's always appreciated. Most importantly, hit that subscribe button for more future videos from me, One Big Beast. I'll see you guys in the next video.